Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel, Zoo Expert here. Today we are going back in time and I am not kidding. This game is called Safari Photo Africa Wild Earth. It's a mouthful, I know. However, it used to be one of my favorite games to play growing up and it's basically just like you get to go on safari in Africa and you get to take photos and it's a whole thing with assignments and all that kind of stuff. So. We're gonna jump right in because it's been quite a long time and please bear with the graphics because they're not the best because this is an old game. I don't even know when it came out. Actually, uh, yeah, no, I don't know when it came out. So uh, we're gonna choose our first assignment, Families of Giants. So we're gonna be taking photos of elephants. Oh, I feel like I'm going through a time capsule. This is so crazy. Oh, we're here. Rise and shine. Good morning and welcome to Africa. I'm Professor James Connors. I'll be your guide here in the Serengeti. And I'm Valerie Devereaux, staff writer for Wild Earth. Welcome to your first assignment as photojournalist. We're glad to have you on board. <gasps> so, Professor, where are we off to this fine morning? Well, I believe in this area we stand an excellent chance of finding elephants. Wonderful. But first, let's get our new recruit oriented. Your controls are listed at the bottom corner of your screen. Uh -huh. There's a keyboard key shown to move about, and your mouse to look around. Click the left mouse button when you want to take a photo. Try snapping a picture of one of the tents here in camp. Piece of cake. You also cool. need to learn how to use the zoom lens on your camera. Hold down the right mouse button, and move the mouse up to zoom in. You can also use your mouse to look at it. Up on top of oh, the I hill see. behind the camp is a lone barren tree. Zoom in and take a photo of it for us. Excellent. Remember to zoom back out after taking photos so you can see what's going on around you. Yeah. Throughout the assignment, you'll be given objectives like these, which will appear in the upper left corner of your screen. Search for these objectives and take good photos of them. The one at the top is your primary objective. You'll need to find it to continue on with the assignment. The rest okay. are secondary objectives. They'll usually be nearby or on the way to the primary objective. Your photos are going to accompany the article I'm writing, so make them good ones. On each assignment, you'll need to accomplish a certain number of objectives to complete the mission successfully. Okay. There we go. Good, that was an easy one. Some objectives will be harder to find, so keep a sharp eye out. If you miss an objective, it'll disappear from the list. But don't worry, you don't have to get every one of them. However, you will need to get most if we're going to make a successful article. So, Professor, how do we find these elephants? There's a sure sign we can use to track them, but they're dumb. You're joking! Not at all. They'll be hard to miss. Adult elephants excrete around 330 pounds of dung every day. That's quite a load of... No, I'm entirely serious. <laughs> Look for a pile of round balls about waist height. Okay. Now we're just kind of... in the wild. Oh man. This game blew my mind as a kid. It was... This was crazy to me. There's some levels... Oh, it's telling me I gotta go that way. There's some levels that uh, you're in an actual vehicle, so you get to drive a vehicle and take pictures. That was like peak, peak gameplay for me at the time. All right, here's a termite mound. Let's, let's do that. Cool. There was also flower, which I don't understand because the flower was with the drabs, but it was in the photo, so like, meh, I don't know. Oh, there's waist height brown balls. I found them. Hey, wait, there's flowers just to the left of it. Maybe I can get both in. I don't think I can run. A wampus! Wait! That's Discord. Wampus is Discord. Okay. Should I just take the flower? There we go. Dung heap and nearby flower dung beetle. Well, there's a dung beetle in here. Zoom in. There. Dung heap and nearby flower. Well, I guess I'm looking for another one. 
Oh, I was dumb. Okay, it's right here. Cool. I think I'm just kind of skipping. Oh, mushroom. Look under the fallen tree. There may be life there that's quite taken with the little niche the elephants are. <gasps> we found an elephant! Oh, we can't get too close though. He doesn't look too happy to see us. No. A young male. He probably got separated from his bachelor herd. He sure is freaking out about it. Well, on the ground. Torn branch. They get frustrated just like humans. Elephant charging. What? Um, are we safe here? I don't know if I like this. Uh oh. That was only a demonstration oh, oh, that's not a fawn branch. <laughs> okay. Are you in must? Okay, goodbye. I feel like I'm following this elephant way too closely, but you know what? That's okay. <gasps> There's more over there. Here, here's vultures. Oh, zoom in or get closer. Okay, well, I'm kind of waiting for Mr. Angry Elephant to keep moving. Uh, there. Look, there's his head over there. Oh, I missed it. Possibly. Let's go in for a closer look. Now be careful. The meter at the top of your screen measures your impact on the environment. We want to be good citizens and not disturb the animals in their natural habitats. If you bump into or otherwise aggravate the animals, the meter will go down. But as you help document the environment with your photos, the meter will go back up. And be careful because if it gets in the red, you'll have to abandon the assignment. So stay sharp and be considerate of the wildlife. Okay. Sounds good. This is a herd of females. Oh good. They won't be so hostile. Now, I wouldn't count on it. Even in the female groups, there's still a strong leadership hierarchy. See that big cow in the middle? That's the matriarch. Really? Okay. I'm doing it. Female Things are happening. The clan. I think I would prefer herd, but okay. All right, so I think yeah, we can't go up there. So I'm gonna just scooch around here. Oh, there's even more over there. Wildebeest looking around is also a side quest, so there must be wildebeest nearby. Yes. Oh, the cap is sitting now. Okay, it wasn't like the best photo, but that's okay. Um, I wasn't eating. Who's eating? Grazing. Couldn't get the elephant eating. 
Okay. Trumpeting. I already got that, friends. Looks like he wants to do a little exploring. I think his mother has something to say about that. Young calves are rarely allowed to stray more than 20 meters from their mother. Okay, there we go. You guys are not eating really. Oh, what's happening? Lions? <gasps> oh my. I'm very close to these lions just now. Okay, done. Oh my. Cool. I'm not interrupting this hunting party at all. Friends, friends, you better run. And there they go. Okay, bye. Nice seeing you. Got other things to look out for. There's a rock. It looks like the elephants gave the wildebeest warning so they could get away in time. Only about a quarter of daylight hunts end in success for lions. Let's see if we can find another elephant family unit around here. Typically a bond group. Of two or three family units like this one that stay within a mile or so of each other. Okay. Which way should we look? Animals tend to congregate near water. Look for any streams or rivers around here and let's follow them. Okay. Stream. Where was the stream? <laughs> was it this way? Oh, wait, I think I see water. I do. Cool. Good. Now follow it downstream. It has to go somewhere. Man, at least I'm remembering how this works. Lions. To bring up your portfolio. Right now you can view, rename, or delete any photos you want. After the assignment is over, you can come back to this screen to reorganize your photos, email them, or print them out. Okay. There's a fishy. Oh. I'm ready. Where did it go? Okay. I was like, where did it go? It's gone. There's tall grass. Oh, there's the warthogs. Oh my. This is like the Lion King. I'm Nala. And there's Pumba. And I'm stalking Pumba. There we go. Got it. Uh, can I uncrouch now? Anytime? Oh, maybe I was not crouched. That's just really tall grass. Okay. Ah, there's some lions. Hi, Rax. Oh, wait, did I see a little thing? Nope, I did not. I'm not sure where the Hyrax was. Maybe I missed it. Hmm. Up here? Nope, that's off limits. There's another fish jumping. Oh, there's the ostrich. Ostrich grazing. I believe this is the nest. Somewhere. Ow! Oh! Ah! <gasps> oh shoot! I'm sorry! I didn't know you were in there! Oh, okay. Yeah, well there's the eggs, so that would make sense. Zoom in or get closer! Do you see what happened when I got closer? I'm sorry. Okay, yep, nope, nope, we're going, goodbye, I'm sorry. Ah. I didn't mean to. Okay, we're gonna go right between you guys. Oh, goodness. Alright, so the lake must be this way. Follow the water. Can I go in the water? Can I just go whitewater rafting down this lake, waterfall, river, stream? All of the above. 
Whee! Here we go. Oh my. Okay. That's not what I wanted. Whoa. <laughs> I was not ready for that. At all. Bathing. Yes. From a tree. Well, it's on the other side. Oh, here's you. Okay. Baobab tree. You got the tree, but not the elephant eating from the tree. Ay, ay, ay. Oh, that tree. Gotcha. All right. Gouging tree. Which one? And where? That one? Actually, they're modified teeth. Oh, 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 we gotta move. Yes, the largest set of tusks on record is 465 pounds. Wow. This is a pretty photo, anyways. Looks like they're having a little family reunion. Aww. This will give us a good look at their greeting ceremonies. Oh, you mean like pinching cheeks and complimenting hairdos? <laughs> Not quite, but elephants do contact each other physically quite a bit. There we go. It's the sense of touch. It's like hugging. It helps maintain their familiarity and reassure each other that they belong. There's also a zebra over there, but I can't really get over there anymore because there's kind of just elephants everywhere. <laughs> and the water's too deep in the lake. Oh, look, there's even more over there. Fun. Okay, so now what? Do I keep moving? No, I have to stay. Which one's making noise? Twisting trunk. Very specific. Now this is that one. This female is actually calling out for a mate. Frogs and dead fish now? Okay. Small portion of the call. Elephants can communicate using infrasound, which is sound so low in frequency, it's below human hearing. These infrasound calls can carry over three miles away. Okay, it's over there. I guess I'm taking the long route, so here we go. <laughs> okay. Looks like the boys are busy being boys. Yes, they're sparring, not really fighting, just sizing each other up. I'm still looking for frogs and/or dead fish. Oh, now I gotta go back over here. He's angry. He's gonna take out his anger on the tree. And then you're in the mud. gonna be late for this oh here it comes Do it. Where do I gotta go now? Hmm. It's getting late. Before we head back to camp, let's wander deeper into the swamp. 
deeper into the swamp. I don't think it's that way. I think it's this way. So. Can't go there. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Sorry. Pardon me. There's another warthog. Oh, look. Three frogs. Okay, well. There happens to be three here. So we're going to just take a picture of them. Again! <laughs> oh, it's a family of warthogs. Look at them. Oh. Seems the elephants aren't the only ones who enjoy a good roll in the mud. Yes, both elephants and warthogs like to wallow in mud to keep themselves cool. Okay. What's over Let's here? Those old elephants shouldn't be far oh, are they crocodiles? <gasps> They're crocodiles! Hey, friends! You're not quite swimming. Uh, maybe there's another one of you. Oh, yeah, over here. This one's swimming. Okay, I'm zoomed in. I'm ready. Can I get both at the same time? Hey, 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 you. Okay, there. This refers to the place elephants go when they're older and sexually inactive. These old bulls this like game is real and honest, jeez. Vast amounts of herbage here before their last molars wear out. Speaking of which, I think it's about time we get back to camp for dinner. Mm, yes. Herbage awaits. Herbage, oh my. <laughs> okay, so... Assignment finished, press spacebar to exit. Cool! Wow! View article. Oh, it's an actual web browser thing. Okay, dokie, we're gonna cancel that. <laughs> okay. Wow! Portfolio, families of giants. Oh, look, now we can see all of our photos. How cool is that? What an adventure we went on today. Alright, so this may not have been the most entertaining thing, but like, I'm just having fun. So, if you want to watch, and you want to stay tuned for more, just, you know, you can subscribe or whatever. You don't have to, I'm not forcing you. But like, if you want to stick around and have fun, then please do. So, I guess with that, I'll end this episode here and I'll pick up with another one, um, soon. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next episode.